My name is Javad Fardai. I'm presenting Universal Time. Time has been mispresented from the beginning of the Big Bang Theory until now. Or perhaps the Universal Time has been honestly misunderstood and mistakenly replaced by our Earth Time and no one has ever noticed that these two are different from each other. Thus, the standard of Big Bang Theory is science fiction. Simply, they create a fictional theory without any consideration of the scientific spec of it. Let me explain. Albert Einstein's misunderstanding of time. To begin with, his brilliant mind created what he called time-space, which means that time created space. I am not going into detail of his theory of time and space or what was later called a space time but I will concentrate just on the time aspect only. The question is what is time? Generally we know only one concept of time. It is worldwide time made of second minutes an hour. I call it AM PM time. It's a man-made time based on rotation of Earth around the Sun. When we set our clock one hour ahead or one hour back, it does not affect anything. It does not change the rotation of Earth around the Sun, nor does it slow down or speed off the Earth revolution. Basically, our Earth time is a meaningless. It does not have any real value or character or power to create or affect anything. We give our Earth time 12 hours for daylight and 12 hours for the night time for the east in measurement of daily routine. The AM PM give us the sense of knowing the first and second part of the day only. But there is another type of time. It is real time that we truly don't know much about. But it is the time that created the space of universe and it started to tick billion years ago and created the universe. It's called universal time. The first moment that real time tick the moment in the universe it started and created the space inside the universe. The space of a space followed by this tick of time and the space created life inside of the universe. It's very obvious that we do not know anything about that moment or what caused this time is to take. However, it's very important for us to realize that this universal time is very different from our Earth time. This time was not made by human or have second minute or hours to create the days and men or months. This time has its own unit and cycle that blend with the space in such a matter as to complement each other. This time is a creator of the universe. It has created us and we cannot touch it. We have no control over it. We cannot travel through it backward or forward. It does not slow down in any condition. It's always sticking at the constant rate. It's never affected by mass or without mass. It does not slow down in basement or speed up on a higher level. It cannot be absorbed to move differently by different absorber. This time belong not only to our Earth or our galaxy but to the whole universe. We have to think deeper on this time to understand it. Yet, we are not even sure when this time started and how it's working. But one thing is for sure, it does exist. And we are hard evidence of it. This time is taking as long as universe expanding. But the only things that we can feel of this time is through our biological clock. We should consider that if the Earth for some reason was wiped out of the universe, the AM PM time that we are practicing will go with it. But this universal time would still continue ticking at the regular basis. 
This duality of time is space that Albert Einstein introduced. It's a follow yin and yang principle. All the elements of yin and yang are complementing each other. At the same time, they are indivisible. Because of that, the time and the space must be intertwined and never separate from each other. Which means that as long as the universe has a space, the time is taken. This is a solid evidence that space never goes to infinite. Sadly, at the beginning of 20th century, when Albert Einstein proposed his theory of general relativity, it stated that time created space. The time that he proposed created the universe was based on our Earth time. Why? My assumption is that the concept of understanding the difference between the real universal time and over man-made time even fooled Albert Einstein's. Therefore, when Einstein introduced his general theory of relativity, even his vision did not detect this original universal time. If he could distinguish our time from universal time, we would not be so confused about the universe. If you are familiar with the Big Bang Theory, you know that from then till now, the grand design of time that created space has never been mentioned anywhere after creation. We honestly misinterpreted our Earth time with the universal time. And so when it comes to the time that created the universe, we are counting by our physical man-made time that we created a few hundred years ago which is relevant to Earth only. Simply, our minds are locked on Earth time. Now, if you start to believe and accept that grand design of time that created space does exist and that is different from the time that we know on Earth, then the whole structure of knowing universe, even by Big Bang standard, including general and special relativity, will be changed forever and put us on the right track to believing a quantum mechanic universe.